What's up YouTube? Coming at you with a quick journey into Nick's Fat Pack. This is my last one that I got. These were dirt cheap off TCG Player. They were about $17 flat for each Fat Pack. Uh, and I got three, my cousin got four, and uh, my friend Steven got four. And uh, we just kind of split it so we could buy them all and take advantage of that only $8 combined shipping. Um, so, I already opened up uh, one in Pack Wars, and I opened one up on camera. And the, both fat packs that I opened completely sucked. So this is it. This is the saving grace if we can get our uh, $50 back. <laughs> so let's go ahead and uh, just rip right into this. Cross our fingers. Hope for something good. Um, there are some pretty nice cards in here. Um, especially like the foil hunting, which is what I do. Uh, another white dice. That's kind of crappy for me because I already pulled the white one in the first fat pack that I had opened. So I was hoping to get uh, some different colors, but um, that's fine. The dice is not what we're here for. But anyways, back to uh, some of the things that we can pull. Uh, foil Mana Confluence, the uh, Johnny Mentor Heroes, uh, Foil Karanos. We got some nice foil uncommons like Banishing Light, Nick's Fleece Ram. Even Brain Maggot would be kind of cool. Um, so, without further ado, let us get to cracking. So, two fat packs that I've opened, 18 packs, zero mythics. So let us hope that this one has everything that we desire. <laughs> zoom in a bit here. Alright, so we've got a, uh, a Game Warden, Thassa's Ire. Gnarled Scarhide, and Twin Flame. Not off to a good start. <laughs> Although Twin Flame is a pretty nice card in the limited environment, I suppose. If we were playing Pack Wars, that would have been pretty decent. Crystalline Nautilus. Mogus's Warhound. Storm Chaser Chimera. And King Makar. And a foil ritual of the returned. Nothing too exciting there. Got a Dacra Mystic. Reviving Melody. Gold Forge Sentinel. And Dictator Erebos. And a gold. Gold. Yeah, not a big fan of the Dictates. I think the Dictate of Erebos is probably my favorite one. I guess the foil version. Oh, I think we got a foil black card. Spite of Mogus, first uncommon. Whitewater Naiads. Crow and Line Breaker. And Silence the Believers. And a foil aspect of Gorgon. Pack number five. Hmm. Might be a foil in this one. Uh, Disciple of Deceit. Hour of Need. A Brain Maggot. And, hey, finally we crack a Mythic. Wow. <laughs> I am so happy that we cracked a Roas. God of Victory. Uh, this guy's not really worth anything. Uh, a few bucks, I think. But, uh, yeah, a Mythic. I'm happy about that. No foil. Keep uh, keep that good luck going. Ooh, we definitely have a foil on this one. I think it was blue. Um, Phalanx Formation, Reviving Melody, Gold Forge Sentinel, and another Dictate of Erebus. What is up with all my fat packs having double rares? I know it's a small set, but, I mean, come on. All right, and the foil is a Triton Shore Stalker. Yeah, this guy is pretty good in the pack wars. 1-1 one, one can't be blocked. You can get an enchantment, because the, the set is kind of removal light, it seems like. I mean, there's a few cards, but... But he definitely can do some work. 
All right. Ritual of the Returned. We got a uh, Sky Spear Calvary, a Blinding Flare, and Battlefield Thaumaturge. No foil. Two packs left, guys. Interpret the signs. No other power. And oh my gosh, another dictate. Dictate of Karmetra. Okay, last pack. Oh man, I need uh I need something good to make this worthwhile. And I've already pulled three foils out of this fat pack, so I can pretty much bet there will not be a foil in this pack. And not gonna get anything good. Alright. Last Uncommons, Desperate Stand, Golden Hide Ox, Leonin Iconoclast, and Hydalon of Blossoms. Well, boy, I just really have had some pretty bad luck with sealed products. So, recap, we got the uh, Eidolon of Blossoms, Dictative Karametra, Battlefield Thaumaturge, Foil, Dictative Erebos, Iroaz, Finally, nice to pull a Mythic, at least. A Mythic. One Mythic out of, what is that, 27 packs? Aspect of Gorgon. Yeah, those odds uh, don't seem correct. Silence the Believers. Gold Token. Dictator Erebos. Foil. Ritual of Return. King Makar and a Twin Flame. Um, I don't know. Maybe, uh, maybe get what you pay for. <laughs> uh, no, I think... Uh, well, I'll be interested to see what my friend and uh, cousins crack in their fat packs. Obviously, the Pack Wars, he had that Temple of Epiphany and the and a Eidolon of the Re Great Revel. Um, so those were solid cards, you know, both like 8 bucks or so. But, um, yeah, my Fat Packs royally sucked. Definitely did not get my $50 back. Uh, hopefully provided you all with some entertainment. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, so I will catch you guys all later.